it's me again, Mom says. So, in this video, pag-uusapan naman natin yung about sa percent by volume. Okay, so percent by volume is more convenient to use when both solute and solvent are liquid. So, percent by volume expresses um, the number okay, of volume of solute per 100 volume of the solution. So, um, proof of and use for by expressing the strength of alcoholic beverages is twice the percent alcohol by volume. So, an 80 proof of wine is 40% alcohol by volume. So, which means that a 100 ml of the wine contains 40 ml alcohol. Okay, so ganun, ganun yung um, idea ng percent by volume. So, for you to get the or compute the percent by volume in a given problem, so percent by volume is equal to volume of solute over volume of solution multiply it by 100 percent okay wherein your volume of solution is equal to um volume of solute plus volume of solvent okay only on the assumption that volume is considered or neglecting any volume change okay so let's have an example so for example we have here the given problem how many ml acetic acid is present in 1.0 liter of 3.5 percent by volume vinegar okay so same lang din ng mga given problems natin kuhanin natin yung given so ang given natin dito we have percent by volume, okay, which is 3.5%. We also have the volume of solution, which is 1.0 liter vinegar. Okay, so ang ahanapin natin dyan, o yung required, is the volume of acetic acetic acid okay so hahanapin natin aalamin natin kung ilang ml ng acetic acid ang present sa isang litro ng 3.5% by volume of vinegar okay so don't forget our formula we have here the formula percent by volume is equal to volume of solute over volume of solution times 100%. Okay? So, our solution now will be, ayan, analyze natin. We all know that this 3.5% by volume vinegar is equivalent or it means that there are 3.5 ml of acetic acid in 100 ml vinegar. Or, susulat natin siya, means we have 3.5 ml acetic acid sa 100 ml ng vinegar. Okay, so kung kukumpute na natin yung um, volume ng solution, we have here volume of acetic acid, a volume ng um, acetic acid is equal to Okay, you get the volume of solution. We have 1.0 liters 
vinegar multiply it by 1000 ml vinegar all over 1.0 liters of vinegar okay so bakit natin siya um minultiply sa ratio ng liter and ml kasi we have here the given m uh, the given unit of acetic acid na ml so dapat maging ml din siya okay so mamaya pakita natin yung cancellation so times so if we have here the 1000 ml vinegar multiply na natin siya dito sa eto sa um, 3.5% by volume ng vinegar. Okay? So, we have now 3.5 ml acetic acid all over 100 ml vinegar. Okay? So, we can now cancel the units before we get the or before we compute for the final answer. So, cancel the liters of Ito rin, liters, ml, and ml. So, ang matitira natin dito ngayon is the ml of acetic acid. So, your final answer here, so 1.0 liters vinegar times 1,000 ml of vinegar over 1.0 liters vinegar times 3.5 ml acetic acid over 100 ml vinegar. We will have now, ilan? Okay, very good. We have... 35 ml acetic acid. Okay? So, ibig sabihin yan, there are 35 ml of acetic acid present in 1 liter of 3.5% by volume vinegar. So, this will be your final answer. Okay? That's all for today, 4% by volume. If you have questions regarding this, please comment or just PM me. Thank you for listening. I hope you learned something today. God bless us all.